Around the nation tonight, music mogul Sean Diddy Combs pleaded not guilty to multiple charges, federal charges, including sex trafficking in a New York courtroom. Some of the accusations stem all the way back to 2008. And we do want to warn you, some of the details in this case may be disturbing. CNN's Laura Aguirre has the latest. The newly unsealed federal indictment charges Sean Diddy Combs with racketeering conspiracy, sex trafficking, and interstate transportation for prostitution. Combs abused, threatened, and coerced victims to fulfill his sexual desires, protect his reputation, and conceal his conduct. Graphic details in the indictment accuse Combs and his associates of allegedly forcing female victims to engage in sex acts with commercial sex workers. Combs allegedly planned and controlled the sex performances, which he called freak offs. And he often electronically recorded them. Combs is accused of using drugs to keep his victims compliant, among other tactics. He was violent and he subjected victims to physical, emotional and verbal abuse so that they would participate in the freak offs. Earlier this year, law enforcement raided homes owned by Combs in Miami and L.A., seizing a cache of weapons and digital recordings, along with other evidence. He's not guilty. He's innocent of these charges. Combs' defense attorney, firm in his client's innocence. To his great credit, he voluntarily came to New York. Not a lot of defendants do that. The rapper appeared in court Tuesday afternoon, joined by family members seen arriving earlier. If he's convicted, prosecutors say he faces up to life in prison. He's going to fight this with uh, all of his energy and all of his might and the full confidence of his lawyers. I'm Laura Aguirre reporting.